Thank you so much to the members of this channel. If you would like to become a member yourself, all you have to do is click the join button next to the subscribe hey guys, button. Welcome back to the channel. So before we get into this, I'm going to put the comment of the day up. If you guys want to take part in that, all you have to do is leave a comment and I randomly choose them for my new notification. So today we are back and playing some single daddy and we are just waiting for the baby to be born. Baby is because I just know, I just know it's going to be more than one. I really hope that it's not, but I just know. <laughs> uh, so we did go ahead and have him search the garbage can off camera and we need to analyze prints at the police station, which is what I will be doing today. Everybody is just kind of getting up and getting ready for the day. Yeah, look at that stomach. There is no way there was only one baby in that thing. Uh, <laughs> so, girl, come on. I mean, it really just was not that hard to eat. Your soup, he needs to get himself taken care of. I think most of the kiddos... Oh, they're gonna, they're gonna have a balloon fight. Most of the kiddos are doing okay from the looks of it just a little hungry oh my god i forgot the dang snake got loose again and now i have to find where the snake is it looks like we got oh my god the baby's here now the baby's here the baby's coming i should say i don't know where the snake is um so that's gonna be fun trying to figure out where our little snake went to um uh, because I don't think any of the kids have the snake. I'm double checking, but I know it said that it escaped this morning. So I guess we're going to have to figure out where it escaped to. Oh no, our dinky lime pie. I forgot about it. It's rotten. Okay. Anyway, there's so much going on right now. Since she's not going to eat her hot and sour soup, can we? Oh, I guess I can't have her put it away. I'm going to have him. Why can't we put it away? Why can nobody put it away? Okay, well, I guess it's just going to sit there and go bad. Um, let's go ahead and have him take her to the hospital because he made some really horrifying quality food this morning. So there's that. But let's take her to the hospital. Can I put this up now so it doesn't spoil? Because, like, we've already spoiled one thing and it's just going to sit out here. We have so much laundry to do. It's, it's just like a madhouse. Like, everything needs to be cleaned. We need to really take some time, which I'm going to do after we have our baby here. But, yeah, just a whole bunch is kind of happening right now. Did somebody else leave their soup out? Who didn't eat? You? Get your butt over here and eat this food because we are not wasting All right, it. We're at the hospital now. So now we wait. Now we wait to see what we're having how many we're having. I really have my fingers crossed to only have one. Uh, but actually, hold on. Layla and Antoine uh, age up tomorrow. Then Vince won't age up for 12 days. I'm considering, because I need a break, sending the kids away. I'm not going to lie. If I have triplets, everyone's out. Like the house, they're, they're gone because I cannot deal. I will send them to this guy right here. No, I won't. VJ, maybe I will. Uh, or even him, like, uh, cause I cannot do it. Alright, we had a baby boy and he has the loves the outdoor trait and we get to choose another one. So I did see the name Remy. So I liked that one. We're going to go with that and let's see what happens. Neurotic. I mean, that's fine. It could be worse. Please only be one. Please only be one. Please only be one. No, it's going to be another one. Okay. So we have another baby boy born with a clumsy trait. I need to look up another name because I was not ready. I was just, I just had my mindset on having one child. Okay. I saw the name Blaze. So we're going to go ahead and go with that one. So clumsy and perceptive. I am sorry. My brother just texted me and I forgot to turn my sound down. So don't mind that. Uh, but we have clumsy and perceptive. So two. Okay. We only had twins. I can maybe deal with that, but I'm still considering um, sending the kids away for a minute. Uh, but we will be losing two of them because I'm probably going to move Antoine and Layla out. I'm going to be really, really sad leaving her because I really, really love her. Uh, honestly, I hate having any of them leave, but we're going to need to make some space and not stress me out too much. So, I don't know. I'm considering sending these three away for just, like, a little bit, and then we can bring them back maybe when the babies are, like, 
done, you know, learning their toddler skills or something. Because I think we just, by we, I mean me, I need a break. Okay, I need so a break. I did decide to sign up Vince, Shelley, and Caitlin all to uh, we have a party uh, to um, School of Peace and Love just to give us some time to kind of take care of some things and have a little bit of a break. It looks like they are grouping up. I don't know why they're grouping up. I mean, I'm not mad about it, but okay. Uh, so I just want to be able to get this house under control. We will have these two aging up and moving out, and then we can just kind of focus on those two and their relationship. I currently have her trying to do all the laundry because we have every single laundry basket absolutely filled to the brim. Uh, there's just so much going on. He's trying to take care of his garden, so that's just what we're going to do. They grouped up, which I think is quite funny. Um, what are we doing here? What? Oh, is the toilet broken? Who broke the toilet? Go ahead and unclog it. And we're just going to kind of take care of the house things that need to be taken care of. Grab some mail. He is going to take care of the garden. And when he's done doing that, I'll probably have him analyze the prints at the police department just to see what we needed for that. But for now, we're just going to take care of a couple of things around the house. You guys, I have been searching everywhere for this snake. I have no clue where our snake is. Like, oh my god, am I missing him? I feel like I'm probably missing him. I do not know. I do not know. I'm looking. I don't see him. He's not out here. I hope that we eventually find our snake, but yeah, I don't know where, I don't know where he's at, you guys. Like, literally no clue. All right, the three kiddos are off to boarding school. The other two are at school and will be aging up today. And she is back to work. I went ahead and sent her back to work. She ne needs to work on writing. I was having her meet coworkers, but I guess she met them all. So I think... I will have her maybe make some friendships while at work. She wants to become good friends with Victoria, which I'm assuming, yes, is our coworker. So I have him kind of taking care of the babies. They are both probably going to crap their pants, but he is going to eat. And then we're going to go confront about glove uh, to Nick Alto. But we're just kind of trying to get everything situated. I know that you're hungry, but you need to worry about these babies before yourself just in case you didn't know uh <laughs> so let's see are you going to crap yourself right now or are you going to wait until i put you into the crib and then you're both going to is that what's going to happen yeah okay looks like you did already so let's come over here and change remy's diaper i knew it was gonna happen and then change blaze diaper then we'll get him some food and then go confront about gloves and we'll have a couple birthday parties and hopefully everything will kind of chill out. I feel like I'm spending so much time like trying to take care of every single sim that we're not getting to do too much. All right, so Angeline made 1,186 simoleons. I did actually have her listen to her tab cast to learn photography. So she also got like a bonus as well and i think improved friendships with her co-workers which she needs to take a shower because we did not get to have her take a shower this morning so let's make her have a shower and confront about gloves now or yeah we're gonna go confront about gloves since she is home and can take care of the babies if there is anything that needs to be done. So both of the twins were about to head off to their job and I decided to stop them because if they go to their job, we won't have a proper like birthday cake or anything. They'll just probably come home and age up. So I sent them right back home to blow out the candles. Yes, I know that we're late for work. We wanted to have a proper birthday. Oh my God, the mailman's even coming in. I have never, I have never had the mailman walk inside my house. What are you doing? What are you doing? What is happening? Why is the mailman in my house right now? 
I don't know, but I guess they're very happy to celebrate with so us. So because of her success, we get to oh girl, that that outfit. We get to choose a trait. Let's see here. Loser, no, you're not gonna be a loser. You can be a bookworm, that's totally fine. Oh my god, the outfit though, like for sure going to need quite the makeover. So I went ahead and changed her only because I did it for thumbnail purposes. I want your guys' opinion. Do you like the thumbnail being the same every video or do you like it being like changed out every video? I've been trying to test that out. So I want to know your guys' opinion. I'm probably definitely going to have a poll about that as well, but I was just curious. I wanted to do something different. But anyways, so what should we have her lifetime wish be? Let's go ahead and make her a professional author for for the heck of it. I mean, why not? Now we're going to wait for Antoine to age up as well and see how he looks. I will definitely be doing like a full on makeover for the both of them. I just wanted to change her outfit and hair just for, like I said, the thumbnail purposes, but let's go ahead and see what he looks like. She's tooting her horn a little too late over here, but it's totally fine. Oh, of course he has the, why? I still don't understand why you're here. He has the pigtails, but let's see. Um, Vertuzo, you know what? I will go ahead and take that. That is totally fine. He is super adorable. Uh, I will definitely have to fix his hair and I don't know where I want to move them. So let's see. One sim band hit movie composer could be fun. Um, let's go ahead and just go with that. You know, why not? Why the heck? Okay. Not? I fixed Antoine's hair and eyebrows, but I will do the full makeovers off camera because it will take me far too long. Uh, the mailman is even having a slice of cake. Like, has anyone else had this happen? I mean, whatever. I love that he's, you know, getting his free slice of cake, but okay, that's totally fine. We're not going to grab two slices though. Oh my God. What? Oh, because we missed work. I'm like, what are we being scolded for? She's an adult. Like you don't need to scold her. Look at Angeline. She's like, girl, whatever. Your dad's nuts. All right. I went ahead and kicked the two of them out because, um, we don't have a lot of money. So I'm going to have to figure out where they're moved to and the situation at hand. And I will deal with that off camera because I still have to do their makeovers. They also are sleeping but need some you know things going on we're gonna see if we can confront nick alto yet uh she wants to have another baby but girl like no you're very very pushing it because listen we have eight days we already have enough children we do not need any freaking more so i'm gonna let her just kind of take care of them when they wake up which should be probably right now and he is going to go confront nick um, before I get ready to wrap this up. So let's see if we can confront him unless he is still unavailable, which is very possible. I feel like I'll be able to breathe for a moment because we've had nothing but children. So maybe the two of them can spend some time and, you know, go out and things because I feel like they haven't been able to really go out because there's just so many Sims to kind of care for. But Let's see if Nick Alto is available at the moment. I think he is. It looks like he's We've home. learned that he's rich. No flipping kidding. Love that for him. So let's go ahead and confront him. See what he has to say in his little futuristic jacket. I love the sass. Did you see that? He had some sass there. Okay. Um, can we, can we do this? Can we confront him? Like, Nick, come on. I want to, there we go. I want to confront you. What do we have to say about that, sir? Uh, anything? Okay, now we need to bribe him. I don't want to bribe him. Uh, we are not good enough friends with him. I'm pretty sure we're like literally no friendship with him. Yeah, we're not. But let's see if we can convince him. Because sometimes you can convince them. We probably won't be able to. Maybe we can beat him up. <gasps> he said, absolutely not. Do we have a good amount of athletic? We only have three. Do not embarrass me. Do not embarrass me, Spencer. Okay? Like, do not embarrass me. We're going to fight him. If Nick Alto wins, I promise you, this will be so embarrassing. Oh, my God. I, Spencer, I told you. I told you not to do this to me. And here we are getting beat up by Nick freaking Alto. We literally got our butt kicked by Nick Alto. I am 
quite embarrassed. Um, he's mean spirited. Getting stomped in a fight isn't just bad for your case. It's bad for business. Yeah. Maybe we should just bribe him with 10 simoleons because I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't think we're going to be able to really get out of this otherwise. Spencer <laughs> is literally shook that he just took our 10 simoleons and isn't going to tell us a single thing. I'm glad you thought it was worth 10 simoleons, but it's definitely going to take more than that. You know what it's going to take? It's going to take, I am going to have Spencer work out and then we're going to come back and we're going to literally knock your butt on the floor. So just wait. Just you wait. On that note, though, I am going to wrap it up right here. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Don't forget to leave a like on the video as it does help out the channel. Subscribe, turn on your post notifications, all of that fun stuff. I love you all and I'll see you in the next video.